Hi guys and welcome to my channel. In this video I am going to do something fun. I have a lot of new products and I'm just going to use them and we'll see where it takes me. <laughs> so let's go. I will start out this video by using the new sleek color corrector and I will use my finger to apply this. I will use the light pink one underneath my eyes. Also on my entire lid. Some right by my nose to color correct the almost like olive olive color that I have like around my nose and the green one I will use right on this pimple I don't know why I don't take the time to color correct like for an everyday because it makes such a difference for foundation, I will use the new NYX Total Control Drop Foundation in the shade 02 Alabaster. For concealer, I will use the Born This Way from Too Faced in Very Fair and I will mix it with the Kat Von D Whiteout just to lighten it a little bit. So I will use this underneath my eyes and also like on pimples and stuff. To set everything, I will use the Makeup Forever HD powder and I will apply it with the LH Cosmetics Powder Puff. For bronzer, I will use the... Oh, hello. That is a highlight. For bronzer and contour, I will use these two shades. So you guys, I actually have amazing news. I don't know if I should tell you though. <laughs> you know what, before I tell you, I will tell you a little bit about my week. <laughs> because it's Monday today and tomorrow I am going to film a collaboration with a Swedish web store kind of web shop and after that I'm going to go to a hair event that will be the entire day and night so I will be but also I'm going to pick up my Russian visa that day so hopefully I will have the time for both I have to so I'll just have to make some time to go to the both places. But also that same day I am going to do something that I've never done. <laughs> and that is I am going to pick up the keys for my first and my own apartment. Yes, I am going to move finally. I have been trying to find my own place for a long time because as you guys know or you don't but here you go I will tell you I still live at home with my dad and it's really stressful to both sleep be able to relax and work in the same room and it's a very small room you know so it's very um, stressful to work and stressful to just stay at home you know I will probably be there for six months hopefully more I will be able to work a lot better I will be able to have my studio always standing where I want it to be and I think I will eat better I will I don't know be healthier and if you haven't already you have to go and follow my vlog channel because I'm thinking of doing like packing vlogs and moving vlogs and you will get to see my apartment I don't know it will be just a lot of fun and I'm so excited I will use just a tiny bit of this shade as blush highlights I'm going to use the pro light fusion from makeup forever in the shade I don't know 01 I think <laughs> Ooh, look at that. That was beautiful. I have a lot of things going on this week. I am going to Russia on Friday and then afterwards I'm going to Berlin and I will be back on, on Tuesday. I think I will be back. All right. I will use some Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray and then I will do my brows and I will use Fornax in the Infinity Palette from LH Cosmetics. This one but I have a video on that already so if you want to see that just click this link 
So today I just received the Melt Dark Matter Stack and it is so cool. Like it's magnetic. Look at these colors. Oh. I will go in with the lightest shade at first and that one is called Blur. So I will start with this and use it in my crease and I will bring it also down to like the inner corner kind of. I'm going to bring this uh, underneath my eye as well. And then I'm going to use the second lightest shade called Unseen and I will use it pretty much where I put the other shade but I will just increase the depth. depth. <laughs> so yeah, about me moving, if you guys have moved to your own place, if you have any tips for me, I would love to. Uh, hear about any like obstacles that you've gone through when moving or I don't know just some tips it's just insane to go from living pretty much on an island as I do now and I have been my entire life to living like right in the middle of everything not really but like kind of <laughs> And I'm so excited about my studio. I would really love to uh, get some more uh, backgrounds because I don't really like this one. I think it makes my skin tone look very weird. Uh, I want a pastel pink one. I think that would be so cute. So I'm going to fix that. Next up, I'm going to use this one. and It is called Enigma. And I'm going to use it just to deepen the look even more. On my lid, I will go in with the new NYX Away We Glow Liquid Highlighter in Moon Glow. And I will just uh, put this where I want the glow to be, like all over my lid pretty much. And then while it's still like sticky, I will go in with these two shades. Uh, like a copper one and a light beige, very shimmery one. These both are from Makeup Forever and it's their Starlit Powder in 13 and 12. I'm going to apply the darker pigment in the middle of my eye and then the lighter one uh, in the inner corner. And underneath as well because it, it fell. <laughs> All right, like that, and I will go in with this shade again just to deepen the look a little bit. I will also use just the black one called Dark Matter, I guess. I'm just to deepen it a little bit more like that. And for eyeliner, I will use this new NYX Vivid Brights Cream Color in the shade Bad Blood. For mascara, I will use the Miss Manga from L'Oreal. And this is used to darken my lashes because I will use lashes after afterwards and focus more on the lower lashes. Okay, I will apply these lashes and I'm not really sure what they are. I think they're the Ardell Demi Wispies, but I don't know, they look like this. <laughs> All right, and now for lips. I really want to use this one, but I don't know if it will fit. And I have this one as well. Maybe this one. I don't like this. I will change. <laughs> I'm sorry. Or if I just, just use this. Okay, this took a turn. I don't know if you follow me on Instagram, you saw my collaboration with Ida and we did a look with only using red and I did this like smudgy smoked out lip and now I did it again. I kind of like it. Is it just me? I saw some comments saying that they liked it as well so I know I'm not the only one but I understand this is not 
for everyone but I like it, it looks very vampy like I've just been like sucking sucking someone's blood <laughs> last thing I will just put the uh, the red I will use in my waterline and I will also highlight my brow bone with the highlighter okay so the look is done and you guys are probably like what the hell Lovelina you can't walk around like this but I think I can but yeah, other than that, I really hope you guys enjoyed this look. I really hope you guys are excited for me moving. <laughs> I'm so excited about it. So if you are too, please give this video a like. And if you haven't already, go to my vlogging channel so you don't miss out. Before you do that, be sure to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. And like this video and all that so uh, I know that you like it. So yeah. That's it for me. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope we'll see each other in my next. Bye!